Okay, it looks like we are recording. How is it going, people of YouTube and the internet at large? It is Random Geek again, back with some more Paper Mario 64. Last time, we uh, found out that a bunch of shy guys were stealing stuff all around uh, town, and we found their location. And they turn out to be in Shy Guy's Toy Box. Who would have thought it? Shy Guy's being in Shy Guy's Toy Box. And also, last time, we uh, got into a fight with this guy and got utterly destroyed by him, so... I, I got a tip on that from someone who's been playing Paper Mario for a long time now. Apparently he's like a lifelong Paper Mario fan. But, uh... I, um, am not gonna fight him right off the bat. Maybe, like, whenever I'm done with all this stuff in, uh... This area, specifically. In the Chai Toy Box. We'll tackle him, but... I just don't think I'm ready for it yet. Or at least this video, I don't know. I'm kind of recording this, like, kind of late, because I was busy doing uh, other things today, so... I'm just kind of just winging it with what we're going to do. Not to say that that's, like, any different from what we usually do here, because usually we don't even have a clue as to what the heck we are doing. Unless, of course, there is a reason that we need to fight him, like, right now. Uh... Oh, right, right. Oh, great. Oh, wait, we don't have them tattled yet. I guess now would be a good chance to tattle them. This is Sky Guy. Sky Guys are Master Balloonists. Message through 7, attack power 3, defense power 0. We can attack the balloons too. Once they fall, they're just normal Shy Guys. I wish I had a balloon too, so I could flop, float. That looks awesome! Yes, it really does. Can't block. I can't tell if it's just a matter of me sucking at this, but I really can't block. I am not doing good. Like, at all. This is not turning out well for me here. Did I get everything over here on this side? I don't exactly remember. I haven't really been playing games much since the last time I recorded. And that's the wrong party member. I get hit even once, I'm dead meat. What the heck is happening to her? Okay, this was utterly pointless. And that is not what I meant to do, but I'll take it, I guess. I can't really affect you much. I keep on forgetting how to do the ground pound. What does this do? Like, where does it take me? No! <sighs> Darn it! I'm about to die.
I really don't want to waste a fire flower. Stop looking on other applications. That really didn't do anything. Oh gosh, I need to take him out, don't I? I can't think of anything else to do. Let's go back into town to heal up. I haven't really tried going out yet. Besides, you know, just hopping out, I wanted to just go back and see if I can at least heal up and get myself a few items. Unless I have some items stored that I can just grab easily. That are good enough. Yeah, stone caps. Stone caps. And then just abuse Kumbarius. Here. It's right, I forgot we got that. Alright, Mario, you did it. You got my you got back my storm key. Thank you so much. You saved my livelihood. Tell you what, take anything you like from the storeroom. Just a little thank you from getting back my storm key back safe. Really? I could just take anything in here? Well, this one I don't recognize. A very well designed toy train. Can this be more than a toy? And. What does this do again? Crushes all enemies with 4 damage. That actually sounds like it would significantly be better than a fire flower. Or even a dizzy dial at that. What does this do? Very tasty tonic cures poisoning and shrieking. So you think we can do standard business now? Uh, I need to check in some items. We can check in those cake mixes. Super Soda doesn't really feel like it would suffice right now, anyway. I feel like I'm just gonna grab maybe two mushrooms and... Wait, it attacks all enemies? Yeah, I'll sell it.
I really hope I'm doing the right thing. Great. <sighs> I forget that with the Xbox controller I'm using the right stick, which is acting as the C buttons on an N64 controller, is acting uh, also as like a mouse. So wherever I move the, the stick, the mouse will also move correspondingly. And unfortunately, that means that any time it moves off of the uh, window that I have for the N64 emulator right now... Well, Dolphin. I'm using Dolphin, that's right. So anytime, whenever I move it off the window that I have the Dolphin game open for, it will uh, start at acting as like a mouse hovering over any other application, and if I press the, trig the left trigger, which I have for the Z button, then it will go ahead and act as though I am, uh... It's, it also acts like a left click on a mouse, so whenever I do that... No, it's a right click, actually. It'll act as a right click on a mouse and just go ahead and click onto that. Yes, please let me stay for a bit. I am dying. And I don't mean that metaphorically. I am damaged in heart and soul. And we need a save. Oh, I didn't even know that that was like a little side quest to help her. Well, I'm, I'm sure it's not a side quest, just, you know, a little something something to do. I to close up shop, some idiot shy guy stole my calculator, can you believe that? I need that thing to calculate my sales, bud. I'm not a genius, when I find that little punk. Here you go. Hey buddy, is that my calculator? You're telling me you got it back from the Shy Guys? Yeah, in your face, Shy Guy. I can open my shop again. Oh man, how can I repay you? I know. Take this. Special badge, bud. So use it with care. I spy badge. A sound and icon alert. I mean, a sound and icon alert you to a nearby hidden panel. That says we could have gone out of business if we hadn't gotten that calculator back. We can open up the shop again, all because of you. Thank you, mister. Alright, Pop. Uh, Wicked. Wicked to hear. Oh, it's you, Mario. What fortunate timing. Hmm? Tom seems to be pretty active today, but it's not my concern. I had a dream last night, and another oracle spoke to me. His voice was heavenly. If you keep going around and around the red palm tree in the distant desert, the distant desert down, dry, dry outpost, something good will happen. So said the voice in my dream. It doesn't seem to make any sense at all to me. But thinking about it, it makes me uneasy that I can't sleep at night. If you could find out what it means, please tell me. A red tree? Is there anyone else that we can head out, like, around so that we can, like, scurry off the shite guys? This video is probably gonna be a lot of me doing nothing, isn't it? Making no progress with the story. Words are mocking me, I need that dictionary. Oh, I guess I just missed a shy guy over here. That mean I miss anything over here? I 
guess not. I am going to guess that the shy guy went back to the toy box. What's in here again? I don't remember. Yeah. It was this vid this one, that's right. Right here. Oh, I need to look at something. Wait. Oh. Is is that what I need? Is that... I, I need this to continue, don't I? I don't feel confident enough yet to fight the anti-guy yet, so... What does that mean? Give the storm key back to the storekeeper. You must be super happy. Happier than I am anyway. I still not a train, so I still have a job. Pitiful. Sad. I mean, not pitiful. It's just sad. I think he tripped over himself. Uh where are we supposed to take it then? I'm an idiot. Wait, how was I supposed to know to do that? I don't even think I could have known to like interact with the box before like that. Oh wait, that's what he told me. Yahoo! We're back in business! This train just dropped out of the sky and onto the tracks. Public transit's up and running. The train's running again! We can leave any time! Okay, uh... Which way is it going, anyway? Is it going right, or is it going left? 
we just... Do I... Oh, I guess it just didn't have a determined area yet. Can we... Oh, wait. Do we need to talk to you, then? Just let me know which direction you want to go. Okay. All aboard. I hit the direction, so... Oh, wait. That's right. That, that, that's right. I forgot about that. I'm an idiot. Do I need to talk to you first, then? Would you like to go pink station? We're leaving! All aboard! I haven't tried doing like a voice like that in a while. I feel like I've completely forgotten how to do toad voices for a bit. Station stop at pink station! Welcome to Pink Station, passengers. Some shark guy just ran off to the way with a frying pan. Oh, I think he stole it from one of his soul. And you know he doesn't really want to cook anything with it. Shark guys are so obnoxious. Tell me about it. There's nothing to explore on the left. Just trying to save frequently. Is he... Is he on fire? <gasps> oh no! Oh, what? I thought I hit it right. Guy. Spy guys look like they're ready for war in their spiffy camouflage gear. Max HP 7, attack power 2, defense power 0. They change their weapons each time they're attacked. You'd best to try and avoid their attack ha their hammer attack. Every time you get hit by it, you'll lose one of your commands. What? Seriously? That's why he's called Medi Guy. Medi Guys are the emergency workers of the Shy Guy Clan. That's your seven attack power one, defense power zero. They have the power to heal their wounded companions. Of course, they also attack. We better hurry up and take care, of, take them out of the mix. It's a pain if they keep fixing all the damage we do. Good. I know this isn't going to take him out, but oh well. Oh wait, never mind, it did. That's right, he's powered up. I completely forgot. go, and two more hits from Gabario, and you should be done for. There we go. No. Everybody calls me Gourmet Guy. I don't know why. I'm just an ordinary food-loving shy guy. <sighs> I'm hungry. I don't really have anything to give you. Sorry, my dude. Oh, we need to get past you, that's what it is. Okay. I see how this goes.
Yeah, I can go ahead and save with this HP right here. HP and FP amount. It's not too much of a low amount right now, anyway. What's in... Mailbag! A, ma a bag full of letters. Return it to the post office. Nice. Oh my gosh. Oh. Gosh. down long enough. Well, I thought I hit it at the right time, is what I meant to say. Now I can't time! I got refunded for the uh, coins I got used on it. I'll just go ahead and use the fire flower. Groove guy. Groove guys wear weird clothes. They probably they're probably stage clothes. Psh, you know performers. Energy seven, attack power th two, defense power zero. They shake their booties to call reinforcements. They also spin around in front of you and make you feel dizzy. These rock and rollers are a drag. So let's ditch them as fast as we can. Oh, uh, come on. Is this where I die? Very close to it, anyway. Dangerously close. in here. Defense plus badge. Increases damage that Mario takes by one. That's it? A single point. I don't... Is that really worth much? Thank you. 
No, oh, come on. I really don't want to do another fight right now. Way to take these guys out pretty fast. Not worth it. Switch out my party members right here. There's somewhere we should go through. Oh. supposed to be able to go through this way too. Wait, do I need to take them out? Oh, it's just a single one of you guys. Ice Power Badge increases attack power against fire enemies by two. Huh. Actually, wasn't there some fire based enemies in here? There's a fire shy guy here, I remember. Taste Tease Frying Pan. Return it to her. You got it. points away from reaching the next level up. 
I better put those points towards health. And speaking of healing, I should probably uh, go ahead and head back to town so that way I can heal up. Oh, right. Taste tea. You're coming to visit, but I'm afraid I can't cook now. So sorry. My dear old frying pan was stolen by a shy guy. It really burns me up. Okay. Oh, Mario, my dear frying pan. You saved it from the shy guys. Thank you so much. I'm going to make you something extra special. Tra la la la. Cake! You got cake. Cake baked by Taste Tea. Stores 15 FB. The most delicious cake. One taste. One taste of it won my late darling's heart. I swore I would never make it again. Make more very special for you. Just one bite will make anyone go gaga. Is. Is this what we need to give the shy guy? Well, I guess gourmet guy. So, how many of my items did I use? Oh right, I used the Fire Flower and the Super Shroom. Yes, just refresh my soul, please. I constantly feel like I'm on the brink of death. Life is... Exhausting. Okay. Well, it's already gonna be 9 o'clock, and I feel like we've done at least a little bit of progress here. So, I feel like I'm just gonna go ahead and call this video here, so... Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and a comment, because I always read the comments on these videos. It's just that I don't always respond to them because I have a horrible track record of not being able to have the thing to say. Not to say that I don't really have, want to say anything I do, it's just that I don't really know how to start these kinds of things. And also, please consider joining the Random, random Brigade today by subscribing where you're currently at 79 subscribers and I am honestly amazed by that. Because uh, I never just really expected to get any subscribers on this channel. And also, uh, I forgot to mention this at the very beginning of the video, but I have, for the recording, I've had a, uh, a can of green tea with honey and half a box cup of, uh, RC. I didn't really have time to make hot tea because I, I just wanted to do this before it got really late. And also... Because uh, I'm hoping that this will come out on uh, Saturday, Saturday, uh, February 26th. I mean Sunday, February 26th. Um, happy birthday to retro gamer Yasuke! I heard that it was his birthday today, and I figured I'd go ahead and try to make one video because I remembered him saying a while ago that he wanted to see me put out another video on my channel soon. So why not pay for Mario? Because He's been looking forward to me putting up more Paper Mario videos on the channel, so why not? Even though I couldn't even really make much progress, 
I hope that he's cool with that. Yeah. Go ahead and check out Retro Gamer Yasuke's channel, also. Uh, he is currently doing a Let's Play of the game Gauntlet, if memory serves me correct. I believe it was called Gauntlet. And also, he's also doing a Final Fantasy Let's Play of the uh, remake of Final Fantasy 1 on the NES that came out on the PSP. He's putting out videos for every Friday. He's gotten up to two videos so far, so please go ahead and check those out. They are both about three and a half hours long, and I haven't gotten to the second one yet, but the first one was really enjoyable to watch. That's right, it was called uh, Gauntlet Legends. That's what it was called. He's doing a Let's Play of Gauntlet Legends as well. So yeah, please go ahead and check out those two if you want to. Um, that's all I really have to say, so... Uh, again, happy birthday to Retro Gamer Yasuke. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Yasuke too, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, that's all I have to really say, so thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Random Geek, and that will be all. Till next time. See ya.